A gem from Toronto's past that's been hidden away for more than 50 years is finally on view for the public. A horse-drawn streetcar from the 1870s is on display at a museum in Ottawa, but there's a petition to bring it home in time for the TTC's 100th birthday in 2021. This is Toronto Street Railway car number 16. It's a horse car. Went into service in 1874. They needed to build systems that would be cost effective, but also could be could run on a reliable schedule and could bring people into the city to work. That blew my mind because I grew up in Toronto, always riding the streetcar and didn't know we had horse cars. There were many routes like Spadina Avenue, College, King, Queen, Young. So all the main downtown streets had horse-drawn streetcars on them. Now because this vehicle ran on tracks, you didn't really have to steer it, but you did have to control the speed. And this is what you use to control the speed and to brake. It is closed in. Some of the other horse cars were wide open. It did not have heat in it, but it, in the winter, if it were filled with people, it would have, there would have been some warmth inside and certainly protection from the elements. The driver had no protection whatsoever. The horse cars lasted until the 1890s when uh, cities were starting to electrify. The streetcar came to the museum in 1968 as part of a large donation from the Toronto Transit Commission. It has never been on display before. This beautiful horse-drawn streetcar should be in Toronto where it belongs. That motivated me to start advocating for its return and hopefully one day a proper Toronto Transit Museum. We do have a number of old vehicles that we've preserved on property. There are vehicles that are around Canada that people have preserved. Um, so with the 100 year anniversary coming up, really it's about uh, now we, you know, we'll spend the next two years really sort of figuring out a way to celebrate the milestone. Um, you know, if we can set up a museum of some sort, that's certainly something we're looking at. I mean, how can you appreciate what you have today if you don't know where we came from? And Trevor, who you just heard from there, has started a petition to bring the streetcar home. You can see that and a gallery of photos from the Toronto Transit's history at our website, citynews.ca. The Canadian Science and Technology Museum says there are currently no plans to take it on the road, but they're always looking for ways to share their treasures with Canadians.